Six decades after the end of World War II, the death of Adolf Hitler remains a baffling mystery. Only one of the eyewitnesses to Hitler's last days is still alive. Brochus Misch was in the Führer's bunker on April 30th, 1945. Now 92, Misch was just 27 when he was a member of Hitler's elite bodyguard unit. Hitler was paranoid about being captured by the Russians. He began methodically planning his own death. Hitler had asked his doctor, I will kill myself. What's the best way? So Professor Haase explained to him, capsule and shooting at the same time. That would be best. On April 29th, Hitler married his longtime companion, Eva Braun. The next day, the Fuhrer met with his few remaining friends and staff outside his study to say goodbye. Then Hitler and Eva closed themselves into the room. Misch remained at his post. He says someone yelled they'd heard a shot, but no one moved. A lot of time passed until somebody said, now open the door. Of course I was curious. I took a step forward to look inside. I will never forget this. Hitler by the table, his head on the table. And Eva lay on the couch her head towards him. But no one saw Hitler pull the trigger. No photographs were taken, and no body was ever produced. I don't believe Hitler died in a bunker. Author H.D. Bauman spent six years researching his recent book about Hitler's fate. Stalin told uh, the Allied leaders in Potsdam in July 1945 that Hitler escaped to Spain or Argentina. Baumann believes Hitler got out of Germany and traveled by U-boat to Argentina. And Baumann isn't alone. The FBI did investigate the many rumors that came out of Argentina, but uh, not much came out of it. The FBI officially closed the case on Hitler's death in 1956. 11 years after the war ended. But speculation continues to this day that Hitler somehow escaped and lived out his days plotting revenge. 